苏醒了，猎杀时刻。Oh, oh, he's got him. He's in trouble. Masuda's in trouble. It's over. And. He's a great guy. He's a great guy. He's a great guy. He's a great guy. He's a All right, Arugula, just giving him the stare, and they're off. Arugula 直接勾勾手指，示意对方往前站站，也不浪费自己的力气。增田义介就像是一条滑溜的泥鳅，而日格勒怎么都抓不到他。不过增田义介这种消极的战术引起了裁判的不满，直接叫停比赛，给了增田义介一张蓝牌的判罚。Point deduction. Yeah, see, this this is what's um <laughs> gonna cost him another point. Just okay. circling away, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. Another dancing move here. But Masuda has to be careful, though. He's not doing this to be funny. You know, he's doing it on purpose. Doesn't want to engage right away. He wants to Arugula to change. 比赛重启后，增田义介继续执行自己的马拉松战术，这让敖日格勒非常的无奈，就连场上的裁判都看不下去了，当即就要再次亮牌。增田义介赶忙一个下前抱摔，结果直接被敖日格勒压在了身下。Okay, can Masuda stand up and take the side control? Okay, it's not a choke. Now get us working towards the back if he pulls that leg across. Does he have that move though? Arigala looks like he's just holding on to him. Or he has to turn right to get up. To do that, Arigala has to pull his left arm to the ground to make that base to stand up. Yeah. Masuda almost has that side control. Arigala has to give up the left hand and get up right away. I think he's concerned. Yeah, if he gives it up, that Masuda might turn. Okay, this is the this is where he doesn't want to be. This is what Masuda wants. This is not. Oh, look at this! Just using that weight. It's just nothing. It's a non-issue. Because Arugula is so high, even even when he's laying down. Oh yeah, just roll. Yeah, it's hard. It was hard for Masuda to keep that balance. Oh man. On top of Arugula. Maybe maybe.
yeah, I, I, I think Masuda's surprised at how easily uh, Arigula was able to just kind of slip out of those situations. That's something that yeah. he didn't expect. Yeah. Uh, have, you, have you have you ever seen anyone get from the bottom positions up up to top that which is which is one roll? That, that happens a lot in jujitsu games because uh -huh. you think your opponent is flat, but he's not flat because he has all the mess. You know, he's tall even if he's down. The way he hooked the leg and yeah, the way he went to full mount, he's definitely worked on a yeah. few things. Yeah. Well, in that situation, Masuda should have prepared for the half guard, but he was yeah. off guard. He wasn't trying anything while Arigala is going on top. Okay, you can see signs of fatigue. A little more so on the part of Masuda just from being on the bottom. The second round of the second round, Zeng Tianyijie continues to take his own marathon race, just to try to push time, otherwise he will also be KO'd by Arigala. So the top player of the high level will not be able to get it. There's three five minute rounds, this is the second round. Masuda in blue and Arigala in the red and yellow. Arigala is a little gassed. Yeah, you might see it. It might be a case of who can last the longest. You know, who's going to gas out first? Who might decide the winner of this fight? Masuda wants that takedown. And Arigala knows that he's waiting for that. Yeah, he sprawled really nicely in the first round. And the takedown. Masuda just looking Arig Arigella just straight in the eyes. Facing Zeng Tianyijie, this kind of unfair fighting, the judges are also a bit unsure. At this time, Zeng Tianyijie has been able to fall down in the first round. This time, Arigella has already prepared, directly holding his head down. This time, Zeng Tianyijie is completely defeated. Just knows how to. Yeah, I mean, that was the only thing Masuda could look for. Like, he fought more than 20 times, and he showed it too many times in his previous fights. See, Aoligala, he doesn't... He also trains for this fight, right? He should have studied Masuda, but he has to finish it quick, though. It's great takedown defense on Aoligala's part, too. Yeah, he, plus he's so much heavier, you know, if he prepared well, it's, you know, he should be able to block that shoot. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, especially on the ground, once he gets this kind of dominant position on the top, it's so hard to get out with such a big guy on top of you. But this time Masuda has the half guard, but with that weight on him, I don't think he can do anything there though. He's not looking for a butterfly, he's it's not looking the ribs. for... Huh? Not looking for deep half. Arigala is all over Masuda. Just smothering him. Using his forearm to push on his jaw. Masuda is defending well as a, as a veteran who has more than 20 fights. But Matsuda's got to do something to get out of here. See, he could technically just pop his knee through, you know, go back to full guard. I think he's got a good chance of that. Aragel is giving him, giving him the space to do that. His left knee could come through Aragel's legs and back to full guard. Maybe Aragel's belly is the West pressing, <laughs> pressing his <laughs> leg. Way, right? yeah. It's like a second yeah. defense. Uh -huh. <laughs> I can yeah. I can see it from here that his belly is covering his right. thigh. Yeah. So maybe it's hard for him to move his thigh to the left yeah. side. And even if it does, I don't think it'd be a very comfortable position. But几乎压得对手喘不过气，但是曾田义介也是拼了老命，牢牢箍住敖日格勒，不让他可以肆无忌惮的砸击。可敖日格勒又怎么是他能控制得住的？敖日格勒抓住机会，又一次拿到了其城
Not a right angle though, but... Okay, um, Arigala doesn't oh. have a good position. Yeah, Masuda wants to be careful when trying to escape. He doesn't want Arigala to step over the top and go to side control. It's going to be much harder. Mm -hmm. He goes back to full guard now. What can he do in the full guard? That's a good question. Aragela's shoulders are so wide. He's such a big guy. He's got all that weight down on top of See, to Masuda. Me, huh? If Masuda wants to do something, he has to move his core, but... Go body, go body, go body. And now Aragela is covering his core with his body. 10 seconds oh, left in like the second that. round. Big shots. Okay, Made this, this oh. is going to be really interesting right now because there's a lot of energy that Arigala lost right there. I That's mean, right. he's got some hits in, but you know, you saw him trying to wheel in there, and he's like going, whoa. Masuda looks in worse condition, though. He hasn't got up yet. Slowly making his way up to his feet. He took some big shots. Let's see if he comes out for the third. It's Masuda, all right. He's nodding, he's nodding. He's got some heart. He's gone, but... Doesn't look... He doesn't look good on his face. Still wobbly, Masuda. Yeah, he took some big hits. Yeah, I think this could be over quickly in the third. Arigeta seen it. He might rush. Might rush in. 比赛来到第三回合，敖日格勒不再留手，冲上去就将对手压在龙边，开始重拳砸击和膝撞。And Yusuke or Masuda back with a few of his own and knee to the midsection. Which doesn't really seem to have that much effect. Yeah, he's got a lot of padding. You can hear Aragela putting everything into yeah. those punches. Masuda has an underhook, but... Oh! oh. Very nice counter. He's fighting back. Uh, Masuda is also putting everything. He should have tried this earlier in the fight. That's right, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, if only he'd have thrown caution to the wind and just tried to strike a bit more, he might have had some success. Zeng Tian Yi Jie Bin Si Zeng Zha, Yong Zui Ho De Li Liang Yu Ao Ri Ge Le Pin Quan. 但是这些小拳头打在敖日格勒身上，都如同挠痒痒。由于两人久久没有动作，裁判当即分开了两人。双方回到场地中央继续。But Arigala is just overwhelmed. is tired. Who's not tired here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The thing Arigala's got going for him is he's so big. Even though he's tired, he throws those shots. He's got so much weight behind it. It doesn't really matter. Where's Masuda? He's got to put. 然而还没等曾田义介缓过神来，敖日格勒的铁拳就已经抵达了他的面门。曾田义介当即被砸翻倒地。裁判见曾田义介已经无力抵抗，当即叫停了这一场屠杀。敖日格勒在一次以 KO 的方式拿下了本场比赛的胜利，狠狠地打脸了嚣张狂妄的日本人。敖日格勒接连干掉两位日本悍将，日本官方彻底坐不住了。他们当即派出了日本传奇拳王、日本重量级一哥藤田和之。在赛前发布会上，藤田和之就对敖日格勒大打出手，完全没有把中国人放在眼里。赛前更是狂抽狂言，敖日格勒还是一个没断奶的娃娃，在我面前他撑不过一个回合，赶紧跪在我面前磕头认输吧。出场的时候更是嘚瑟的不行，一副老子天下第一的神情，不把任何人放在眼里，甚至对着镜头做鬼脸。看来对于比赛是。志在必得了。面对嚣张跋扈的藤田和之，敖日格勒又该如何应对呢？
，又一次将日本人击倒，在地面砸拳中 KO 胜出。敖日格勒又干掉了一位日本人，这一下彻底将日本人打怕了，也不敢继续派人挑战敖日格勒了。大家觉得敖日格勒打得怎么样呢？欢迎在评论区留言。喜欢格斗的朋友给个三连再走呗。